Hey y'all, welcome back to Lightworks. I hope that you are blessed and well today. If you are new here, welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. There will definitely be something here for you in this video or in any of the other videos that the divine wants you to see or hear. If you are returning, hey soul family, what's going on? I hope that you are having a blessed and positive day thus far. Please keep in mind that all of my readings are for entertainment purposes only. This is a general and not a personal reading, so it may not resonate with you today, but it may tomorrow. It just means that it is for someone else in our soul tribe here. So take only what resonates and leave the rest for them. If anything comes up related to mental health, physical health, law, finances, family matters, occupations, law, or finances, please do seek out professional assistance in those areas as I am not a professional in those areas. Let's go ahead and get into our breathing. Inhale positive life force energy. Exhale and release any stress or anxiety that you are feeling at this time. Most High God, Divine Holy Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, Spirit Guides, Guardian Angels of the Highest White Light, please come in and connect with me now. Please allow me to channel the current energies for the collective to reveal what we need to know today. Let there be none of me and all of you. Please anoint and authorize every word that comes out of my mouth. Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael, please be present. Please clear out any negative energy, any ill intention or evil eye, any energy that seeks to block this message. I pray that you would block it, destroy it. Please encamp the angels of protection around myself and the collective. Ashe. Okay. <clears throat> you're going to know when you see this I just heard you're going to know when you see this you're going to know when you see this oh, speak Holy Spirit you're going to know when you see this connecting the dots. You're going to know when you see this beneath that spirit guides. And then on the top of the deck before I started, oh, I see. Okay. Are these... going to know when you see this. There's one more here. <clears throat> okay. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Wow. Crossroads. Okay. Thank you, Holy Spirit. So someone is waiting for some type of confirmation about something. This could be about you on being on your spiritual path breaking some type of generational curses this could be about anything look at this it's time for you to know the whole truth the holy spirit is like really speaking right now okay there is some truth about to come into you it's very important that you are keeping your energy cleansed that you are meditating and staying connected Beneath this, we have 
horrible person and misfortune. Not all there. Toxic habits and behavior, okay? So you're about to find some truth out about someone or something. So we have crossroads, which is, I feel like, the present energy. Once you are cleansed and staying connected, your spirit guides are going to help you connect the dots with something and you will have that revelation, that oh, I see energy about potentially some type of a horrible person that has toxic behavioral patterns, um, somebody that's not all there and how you are going to break some type of generational curses. This could be about someone in your family that is a horrible person. Um, or this doesn't have to be, but it could be, okay? Now, there's something significant about a place, okay? I feel like this could be somewhere you're going to go to get insight when this will happen. When this enlightenment light bulb energy is going to take place or where you're going to receive messages. Let's see. Holy Spirit, what is, we have rendezvous point. This is where the enlightenment is going to come in, where you're going to be connecting the dots. And I feel like this says meeting place, destiny unfolds, convergence. So I feel like the meeting place or where this is going to take place is a familiar outdoor space with rendezvous points somewhere you've been before some type of outdoor space where you frequent okay where you are where you go often or where you used to go often potentially with the person that this this other energy or where you go to clear your mind when you feel confused with this crossroads energy. Spirit guides are going to be present at this time, helping you to see something clearly. Horrible person energy is thick. Yeah, angels are going to be there with you. Spirit guides, ancestors. This is going to help you to walk away from something and step into a whole new world. Yeah, chariot energy. Okay, I heard they don't get it. They just don't get it. I feel like, yeah... Somebody is at this crossroads energy going back and forth about a person. You don't see, somebody doesn't see the true identity of someone they're dealing with. And I feel like somebody's ancestor, some, and somebody's ancestor here is a little bit on the no nonsense, cutthroat, zero tolerance type of energy. It's like, they're saying to you, after all that this person has been putting you through, how could you be confused or how could you be going back and forth 
about what's going on, it's evident that this is a horrible person. Okay. Seven of Swords showed up right after that. Okay. Somebody's ancestor is getting frustrated with them. Okay, let's see. Holy Spirit. Yeah, I just saw the Queen of Cups and the King of Cups with the Seven of Wands in between them, okay? This is somebody's spirit, guys, saying protect yourself from this person. It could be protect yourself from the Queen or from the King. That remains to be seen. But somebody's ancestor is like, get in here and connect or get out at this park and connect. Did I show y'all these cards? This is park and this is rendezvous point. They're showing me how everything else is lit up around this area, but this person looks to be very dark. There's something, there's something about this horrible person energy that's, it's almost like they're coming into your peaceful space with this park energy. They're trying to come in, okay? They have, I heard, they've disrupted your peace. Over and over again is what I heard. And this wanted to fall out. So right now, all of this is in the upright. And that's because it's your energy. You or someone in the collective see someone as your upright counterpart. Okay. You feel whether you are the masculine or the feminine in this situation, that this is person is, uh, you feel safe. Okay. Seven of Wands also talks about protection, but the ancestors are saying this person is constantly fighting with you. This person is constantly, I heard, secretive. This is like holding back information or being defensive when you inquire about something, something like that. But this person is a doozy. Okay, so bottom of the deck, Four of Swords, that talks about rest, uh, reflection, meditation, prayer, connecting with your spirit guides. Spirit guides, connecting the dots. Okay, about a Seven of Swords, I went straight back to this deception energy. What's the crossroads? Page of Swords. This is the energy of you gathering insight, information, research, seeing something, okay? This is what your guides are guiding you to do. Pay attention, okay? And pay attention to the downloads that they're sending you, okay? What are you seeing, okay? Somebody's ancestor is just, this read is gonna be short because somebody's ancestor is not about the BS, okay? They're like, what do you see worth investing in with the Seven of Pentacles? Now, I didn't told you who this person is. I have shown you you're not paying attention. You don't see all this stuff that this person has done. Okay, this is your energy. Nine of Swords, constantly stressed out. What is the problem? Seven of Swords. It has to be spell work. <laughs> It has to be. Holy Spirit, what else for Crossroads? I, I don't know what else it could be. Nine of Wands again. This ancestor is like... Leave this person out in the cold.
Queen of Pentacles. This is your energy, okay? Whoever I'm picking up on or someone in the collective is grounded in this energy. It's like you're stable. You feel secure, okay? But you're being guided to walk away and leave this person. Your ancestor is asking you to ask yourself how you feel. How do you feel? How does this person make you feel? Truly, are you happy? Why are, what makes you happy? Okay, again, my disclaimer, I'm not a mental health professional. Your ancestor is guiding you to seek, um, to talk to someone. Okay, and this is no judgment at all. Because there's some type of, that's why I believe this generational curses energy has come out. Because I'm getting the word condition and acceptance. Someone here has been conditioned to accept whatever circumstances are brought in order to maintain the image of commitment and happiness, okay? Yeah, it's like reflection, like, okay, I put all this in, I got to stick with it. What's this message, spirit guides? Spirit guides. The spirit guides. Five of Pentacles. Leave this person. Leave this person. This person. Number one, they're saying this person is not happy with you, and that is why they are giving you the bare minimum, the five of pentacles, mistreating you. This person is an attention, uh, they use the word whore, okay? They use the word whore. Attention whore. That's. This is your energy, but you are just determined not to give up on this. Wow. What's connecting the dots? There's something significant that's about, that you're about to find out the whole truth. Look at this. They said split it again. What they did will shock you. Premeditated sabotage. Okay? You're about to find something out with connecting the dots. We have the three of wands in the reverse. <coughs> Okay. Oof. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay. I just sneeze. Like, sneeze is giving sickness, illness. Three of Wands. Something about this person giving you some type of illness. This person was messing around with somebody close, okay? Three of Wands in the, in the upright talks about distance. It's in the reverse. This person did something with somebody close, got them sick, and this person has either already given you something or intentionally 
plan to with what they did will shock you premeditated sabotage. With the hangman stuck. Something that would have had you stuck in a connection with them, some type of illness. Five of Swords. This person brought this back to your home. Four of Wands. Intentionally, or they will. Three of Pentacles. Someone close that they've been sleeping with. Connecting the dots. Okay, what's connecting the dots and three of wands in the reverse? Ten of wands. This is about to really heavily burden somebody and hold you back. This is going to be what, when you see this, you will know. I believe that that was the first message. Whatever this is, it's going to be a Ten of Wands. And it's going to have you in the Four of Pentacles. And then it's going to piss you off and have you in this energy, wanting to take action. What is the Three of Wands in the reverse and connecting the dots? Knight of Cups. This person that they connected with is someone that you have offered love to not in a romantic way but someone this could be a family member or a best friend or somebody that's really close to you There's something about, okay, connecting the dots. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Okay, I'm getting something about this person telling you they're going to go help someone recently. Okay? This person went to go help someone. And what they did with help someone was help themselves with the cups and wands with this person intimately engaging with this person but this is how you're going to connect the dots there's a specific person that your person said they were going to go help this person is someone you trust and love knight of cups and you looked at it as oh my honey's so thoughtful going to go help this person Okay, this is specific. This may not be for everyone. Or it could have been you were with this person that you love when your person told you they were going to go do something, okay? Something like that. You were either with the person that they're cheating with or they went to see the person that they're cheating with. But you were told that they were going to go help somebody with something recently. Okay? And you were just thinking, oh, this person is a dream come true. They're so sweet. Even though they have had you in the Nine of Wands, okay? You are somebody that's optimistic, that's not a quitter, that knows that people aren't perfect. You try to give people the benefit of the doubt, but the divine is saying that's enough. This person has done too much. Whoever I'm picking up on, you are being guided to take a, to go and visit a doctor's office and to screen yourself to be sure that you have not contracted something, okay? What's OIC? Seven of Cups in the reverse. Okay. Either this 
knowing that this person told you they're going to go help somebody and they went to see this person, there was something significant about that, or you were with this person or talking to this person when that happened, either that or a medical test will give you clarity. Confusion in the reverse, seven of cups in the reverse, oh, I see, okay? Eight of swords, okay? Clarity, this is where your ancestor or spirit guide feels like whoever I'm picking up on, they feel like you are in this eight of swords. You are, you're not able to, to truly see this person's true energy, okay? I'm not getting the sense that this person is a nice person, though. I'm Show me the energy of this cheating person. Something flipped over. Okay, that's way, that's not supposed to be over. Okay, way too many. Okay, show me the energy of this. I'm getting Knight of Wands in the reverse energy. I'm not getting that this person is nice at all. Oh my God, look at this. It wasn't in the reverse. But look, okay, this is this person. Look, Knight of Wands Tower. This is destruction energy. This is exactly who this person is with the Three of Swords behind it, with the Six of Cups. This is the divine saying this person needs to be a person of your past, meaning get moving, okay? Wow. Wow. I'm going to leave it in the upright, but this person is not a knight of wands in the upright. They are this toxic, horrible person energy. What is this person doing now, Holy Spirit? Traveling, spreading disease keeping a whole bunch of people stuck not just you or someone in the collective just a horrible person <sighs> this person is in everybody's bed getting them sick this card represents sickness being laid to rest potentially laying down okay laying their head on everybody's pillow getting folks sick keeping them stuck this person is definitely under judgment. This person's not all there. Not all there. That's that premeditated sabotage energy. Okay? Please go get yourself checked out. What else do we need to know? <clears throat> Look at this. The Ace of Wands with the Six of Pentacles. Out there giving the wand to communities near you, near me, near people in the collective. This person is out there just dipping, okay? With the sicky icky icky. That's a confirmation. You've got to get away from this person. And please, please, please go get yourself checked like yesterday because this person Look at this. Just dropping this sickness all over folks. Just nasty. Just disgusting. Went right back to judgment. What's the outcome for this person, Holy Spirit? King of Wands in reverse. Is being seen. And is about to be met with their karma. Judgment then came out twice or three times. The divine is watching this person closely. I feel like this is how this person is going to leave your life because something's up. I do feel that there has to be some type of heavy spell work. There has to be. Is there any spell work being done on the collective or whoever I'm picking up on? Page of Wands, potentially some type of manipulation going on to see this person as the Ten of Cups. Yeah. So that you would move forward with them. There's definitely something going on here. What else? 
this person has been working on you for a long time and that's why you haven't been able to move forward what else yeah a long time ago you could have been with this person for quite a while What else should we be aware of? Ace of Swords, that's the truth. And this truth is about to come out, okay? So, and you're gonna you're gonna move away, okay, when this truth comes out. So I feel like the truth is going to come, but we saw the park. Okay, Holy Spirit, now look at this. I split it and it looks like this person is under a tree. Could be a park that they're in. And they're in their discontent they're sad okay they're not happy and they're not accepting this cup I feel like this person is gonna come back in this knight of cups energy again wanting to offer the sicky icky icky and you're gonna turn it down because you're going to receive the clarity that you need you're gonna move on from this person I feel like this person is moving on from everyone okay I'm not projecting I feel like this person is either gonna be uh, with this karma energy, this this karma is heavy. This person's either going to expire. I'm just keeping it, just saying it like it is. This person has infected a lot of people. A lot. Holy Spirit, let's do a count. Let's see. I feel like this person has, it's, it's, I'm seeing the eight signs. Like infinite amount of people. Infinity energy. This was a premeditated plan to infect people I feel like this person is deeply wounded we saw not all there okay the moon my goodness nine people lovers okay nine plus seven or this person could just be looking back on how many they got mm-mm-mm this is a deeply wounded person. What's the moon? Deeply wounded person. Not all there. Look at this. Not uh, Two of pentacles to the five of wands. Not all there. Just riding around, dipping it down, causing conflict, trying to destroy whomever they can. And these third party, this is giving the energy of threesomes all over town, everywhere. The cup with the fish in it. Okay. Mm, mm, mm. What else should we be aware of? What do you want our loved one to know about the park? What do you want our loved one to know about the park? That you're gonna be exposed. You're gonna see who this devil is, that this person is truly a devil that had every intention to burden you. You're going to get a revelation when you're at the park or wherever. It's a, some type of outdoor space that you're familiar with that you go. You're going to receive these downloads about this person. Okay? You are being protected. They're trying to protect you from this person. <sighs> Page of Pentacles in the reverse. That's definitely some spell work going on here love spell energy page of pentacles with the ace of cups this is this is giving root work energy what's the final outcome for our loved one holy spirit five of cups this is going to require a lot of healing now i'm reflecting back to when i started the read I'm only, I usually call in protection with Archangel Michael when it's, you know, just to protect our energy. But I do recall asking for Archangel Raphael specifically as well. And this is because there is a significant amount of healing that's going to need to be done here. Okay. With the Five of Cups, I'm asking for the outcome. You're going to be very hurt and sad about this can't make it up for swords okay and the divine is going to be working with you your spirit guides and angels because this 
finding out this information and what this person has been doing and what they've been giving all over is going to create a tower. It's going to. I, find, I feel like another indication is going to be this loved one that you were with um, or that you are close to that's been messing around with your person is going to have this disease as well. Please clarify. I went straight to the devil. This person is going to have this disease as well. And you're going to hear about it. You're going to know. All of this truth is time. Oh my goodness. Now look what this next card is. Okay. Now I don't know if this is going to be this person. I heard yes. Okay. And that's just what it is. I just said this person may very well expire and I feel like that's what's happening here for this person. And you're going to know the whole truth about, I heard multiple people that you know that this person was messing with. The, this, the, the horrible person energy is an understatement. If I can't have you. This person is going to try something before they expire. It says, if I can't have you. When this person comes, four cups energy, and you decline because you have a download about who they are and what they've been doing, they're going to get in this, if I can't have you energy, I'm going to do A, B, or C to cause you a tower five of swords to the tower. And you, the authorities may be involved, okay? Sun card energy. Again, you are under surveillance. The divine is watching over you and so are the authorities. If you feel like you are in any danger, do not hesitate, hesitate to call on the proper authorities to ensure that you are safe and protected. Please do listen to me closely. Again, if you feel like you are in immediate danger, and you need to reach out to the proper authorities to make sure that you are safe. Please do that. You are protected. I am affirmed of that. But this person is not going to be happy. I feel like you're not going to contract whatever this is because God said so. Let me clarify. Holy Spirit, is our loved one safe? Now, they're telling me still go get checked, okay? Whoever you are. Still go get checked. But justice is here. You're safe. Okay? And this person is not. Okay? So, still go and get checked. Just to make sure you're okay. Because this person been partying at a house near you. A house near me. This person's been doing a lot. Queen of winding it. Okay? Okay? This person's been in this Jezebel energy, okay? And again, when they come to you trying to offer this cup of sicky, icky, icky, you're going to decline them and they're going to say, well, if I can't have you, I don't know what else. I'm not projecting the rest of that, but they're going to start plotting on what to do. And I feel like that's going to put a rush on this ending. Because your spirit guides and ancestors don't play. I'm going to get another deck and see. Because there's an energy coming up of sadness. And it's about this family member or friend. That has been involved with your person. I want to tap into that energy. And see what is going on. who's here queen of wands i feel like this is the energy this person is a loosey-goosey as well 
This person has been hiding what they've been doing. I feel like this person has been messing with your person for a while. And I do feel like your guides have been trying to give you signs about what's been going on. That this person has been in competition with you. This person sees you as gullible, naive. I feel like some things have been going on right under your nose, in your home, with your person and your family member or whoever it is, best friend or close associate, cousin, I don't know. It's somebody close though. Somebody who you would leave the house and leave your person and that person together and not question it. That's what has been going on because you trusted this person, but this person, oh my. Look at this sun energy. The divine and your spirit guides have really been trying, but there is some spell work. I definitely know that there's some spell work. Moon mag magic energy. Five of Wands, Page of Swords, Ace of Fire. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. This is sad. What do you want us to know about this person's our collective loved ones, the person that they were close to? Yeah, this is the third party. This person is the, the third party. And this, I notice how I said that you were the Queen of Cups, loving and kind. I feel like with the King of Cups showing up here, this person was returning that energy to you, acting like they were loving and kind towards you, which is why you trusted them so much. This person is a freaking snake. What else for the Three of Earth? Ten of Pentacles, it's a family member for sure. Page of Earth, this person may have been the one doing the spell work. Wow. To the Three of Swords, this person may have been doing spell work. Your own family member. Is this the person, Holy Spirit? Yes. This is. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Wow. I'm sorry, loved one. I'm really sorry. The energy just really shifted. I have so much emotion. I'm angry. I'm sad. I'm... I don't think the person that is not all there that the this energy that's been winding around town I don't think this person was doing any spell work at all I feel like this family member or friend of yours has been doing spell work on you and this person. This person has had it out for you forever. This person has been competing with you. We saw the Six of Cups and I felt like I kept saying, you've been with this person for a long time, okay? This is that energy. This person, your family member that you grew up in a house with has been wanting to bring towers into you your whole life that seven of wands between the king of and queen of cups this is the energy the ancestors have been wanting to let you know that this person has been fighting to keep you from any having any partnerships this person could have destroyed every single relationship that you've entered into since you were a teenager this person is the devil. 
And that's not to take away from this person that was your partner. This person is the devil too. But this one, this family member that's doing all this spell work to keep you in the three of swords indefinitely. This person could have spent a lot of time with you in your home. This person, oh my goodness. This person, y'all. What's going to happen to this family member, Holy Spirit? They've been seen. Son, son. Mm, this is authority's energy. This is hierophant energy. This is the divine council energy. This is major. What is going to happen to this family member? Nine of wands in the reverse okay now if you recall mm -mm -mm. you were the nine of wands up here at the crossroads but you're still standing this person won't be nine of wands in the reverse this person is going to be laid out too right along with this counterpart that's been spreading disease amongst the, na the nation over here What's the nine of wands in reverse? The hermit. I feel like this person's gonna be sick and stuck in, in the bed. Whether they, not that easy, your ancestors said. Your ancestors are upset, Knight of wands energy very passionate in this with this person this person contracted whatever this person had okay and this person is going to be laid out not standing but laying laid out in the house whatever this is is going to eat them up okay and i'm not projecting that look at this eight of swords they're going to lose it okay they're going to lose it for what they've been doing to you what else holy spirit For all the magic that they did. Look at this. To the Empress, which is you. Nine of Swords. I'm telling you, this person is going, all of that spell work, all that they've been doing. Remember I said you were going to be in the Four of Cups, sitting there sad and depressed. This is going to be this person. And I feel like the Divine is going to stretch it out or your ancestors. They're not letting this person. Now, this other person, I feel like this person's, this, your partner is going to be, this ending is indefinite. This is not, they're, gonna, they're not going to let this person just keep infecting people. This person has to be stopped, so they will be. But this person, they're going to suffer before, this is, a, this is how I feel, and I'm not projecting for the person in the back. This is what I'm seeing, because they're not showing me that this person is i'm not seeing death card energy i'm not seeing endings in that sense i'm seeing nine of wands in the reverse not still standing to the hermit this is giving me uh confined to bedridden confined to home with the sickness energy for all the magic magician that they sent your way okay to keep you in the three of swords a freaking family member ace of swords that's the truth this person is going to lose their mind and their health. And you, because you're moving away from this person. Show me the collective, Holy Spirit. Where is the collective going to? The Empress, okay? And the Star. Whatever it is that you are desiring, the divine is going to bring that in for you with the star. They're wanting you to heal, okay? This is going to take time. You're being guided to call on Archangel Raphael because they're going to help you renew your strength, your spirit, your trust. This is going to hurt. I can't even lie to you. This healing is going to be intense, but you're going to get through it. You're going to have what your heart desires, okay? What you dream of. It's going to be there for you. 
is just beyond this Ten of Swords, though, okay? This Seven of Swords that these people brought to you in this Ten of Swords. When you get through this healing from all this Seven of Swords that they put on to you, you're going to have the life that you deserve, okay? Anything else here? Okay, I heard show me the family. Show me the family. I'm guessing everybody else that's involved, they're all upset. Anybody that's in your family that's gonna know about what's happened, they're gonna be in this King of Wands energy. They're gonna be upset with this person. It's all gonna come out, okay? This person, and this is this is multi talent. Excuse me, multi talented in an, another way. Nobody would have expected this family member of yours that's been doing spell work and sleeping with your person. They did not know this person was all over the place like this. They did not know this person dabbled in dark arts or spell work or whatever. They did not know this person was the type that would be over here sleeping. This person was like a shapeshifter. Nobody knew. This person kept their moves dead silent, okay? I feel like there's going to be a lot of people talking about you, posting about you, talking about this, the lies that are coming out that everybody is now awakened to. Okay, and you are going to tell these folks to close the door behind you and never call me, never come see me again, never come near me again. Okay, and you are going to be protected. But they're reminding me to remind you to go to the doctor, get yourself checked out. Look at this with the water here, make sure you are cleansed, clear. Okay, this is that energy protect your energy as well because this person i don't know where there's so much energy out here this could be for quite a lot of people um i don't know where you are on this path so make sure that you are cleansing your energy okay okay with i hear wedding bills so you're going to be eventually connecting with the partner that is meant for you once you come out of this but they want you in this healing energy, breathing, praying, and meditating, staying connected, healing, okay? They're guiding you to get some type of literature. What am I picking up on with the literature? Okay, we have Hidden Helper. So there is a book that's going to be very helpful to you on your healing path. I'm going to try to narrow that down. Let's see if I can get some more insight. Cherish the time that you spend. Okay, this is giving me, cherish the time that you spend in Hidden Helper. This book that you're going to get is going to be your new BFF while you're in your healing uh, cocoon. I'm, I'm seeing somebody that's read a book and they're reading it again. It's going to really, really help you heal tap you into what you need to know okay this is fated to happen this way okay this reading this book is going to direct your path and purpose it's going to encourage you to step in some direction i don't know what book it's going to be it can be millions of different books but for you whatever the book is is going to give you insight that's going to direct you down your healing path okay with Aquarius energy here you're going to be in the spotlight in some type of way this is star energy okay spying on you somebody's gonna be watching okay I feel like it's this family member they're gonna see that you are eventually going to be in this peaceful state of mind in this peaceful place while they're still dealing with whatever they have to deal with that the divine sees fit you're going to be in this fulfilled energy okay because god said so and can't nobody do nothing about it 
they're wanting you to continue to transmute any energy sending sent your way thank you holy spirit anything else look at this i can't make it up this is what this person's going to be dealing with because this is what they wanted to spread around town and this other person wasn't smart enough to protect themselves they're too busy sleeping with your person to even check this person out <sighs> this person i'm getting let me get out of this <laughs> because i'm getting pissed off but this is what this person is going to have to deal with they have a meeting in hermit with their illness and this is where they're going to be and i'm not glamorizing that they're gonna they may be asking you what can I do to make it up to you, this family member? Because I do see a lot of crying on both ends. I do see you having a conversation with this person. Um, but you are going to flee the scene. Okay? You're going to flee the scene. You're going to leave this person, five of pentacles energy, out in the cold. Please clarify. They said, no, I don't need to clarify. Yes, you're going to leave this person in the Five of Pentacles. They do want me to clarify something about this book. Hidden Helper, cherish the time that you spend with this book. What is this energy? Hidden Helper. What is this about, Emperor? I'm trying to tell you, didn't I say? Whatever this is, is going to put you on the path for your divine purpose. Entrepreneur energy boss energy also you are showing up as the empress this book is going to help you heal and lead you right to the right person your divine counterpart beautiful 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 let's get you a mindful message and then get out of this energy yeah this person's going to send you a lot of apologies page of cups energy they're, they're going to send you a lot of messages. You may have to change your phone number and relocate. Because this family member, their life, they destroyed their life. Okay? I feel like with the family, I say, I, show me the family and this King of Wands energy. Angry with this person. I feel like this person is going to be in Hermit isolated because nobody wants to deal with them after they are discovered. And it's going to drive this person nine of swords, eight of swords. What's the advice for our loved one? One day at a time with your healing, okay? You're not in a race to heal. We saw faded, okay? I'm telling you all this projecting energy. Keep your energy cleansed. I wanted to come out. It came out and flipped into the reverse. So, yeah, just protect your energy, Okay? I feel like primarily for it's about this person that you were connected to because until the ancestors and spirit guides and the divine do what they're going to do with this person, this person is going to say, if I can't have you, then I'm going to cause havoc. Excuse me. That's a negative energy coming out. This person is going to be doing a lot. You are protected from this person. Ain't nothing they can do but try to sin. They're going to get mad because they can't infect you. Mm-mm-mm. Talk about horrible person. Confirmation. 